gun nailed up on that wall. No, this is private property. Mr. Geddes don't like trespassers. Was that so? Yes. You hear that? He don't like trespassers. <laughs> That's what I said. Well, does he like dead bodies on his property? No, no, come on, mister. Tell your friend, Mr. Geddes, he's gonna sell this place. The only thing he needs to decide is what he loses before he sells. Oh, I'm real frightened of you. <laughs> you wanna watch your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy pants get. He's paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> oh, oh, get him now. Come on, get him. Oh, kick his head in, boss. Clean my boots. Oh, he's licking you, boss. Boss, boss, you need help? Oh, no. Get, off. Get off that man. Get off. He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. 